Agent Legend reporting in for Team Sigma 7. Uh, hi guys. I know you're probably concerned about, you know, what happened last time. Let's just say the local police don't really take too kindly to us SCP folk. So, yeah. Let's just say there's a hotel room full of dead cops now. Anyway, today I have an object for you. SCP number 1478, also known as the Being of Emotion, Class Euclid. Containment Procedure 1478 is to be kept in a 5, mil 5 meter by 5 meter by 5 meter cell, and it is to have a rest area, a play area, and the doors are to be locked at all times. The doors are to be 6 inch steel plated doors and are only to be open for the two hours that it is allowed out of its cell and for cleaning its cell. 1479 is allowed two hours out of its cell while out of its cell it can roam site 19 as long as it does not attempt to leave. Description 1478 is a mostly white humanoid being. It is one foot eight inches tall and 7.9 pounds. It has two tails that end in a leaf-like tip with a red jewel in the center of each tail. It has pink hair, which also has a red jewel in the center of its forehead. 1478, although having feet, does not use them. It has the ability to levitate with no strain at all. Personnel that 1478 does not like are not allowed access to 1478 at any time. 1478 has a strange ability to amplify emotions to an insane degree. People that 1478 like, personally like, that come into contact with 1478 experience extreme glee and joy. People 1478 does not like, that come into contact with 1478 experience extreme depression, suicidal thoughts, and homicidal thoughts. The way 1478 does this still remains a mystery. So there you have it guys, 1478, the being of emotion. I had a friend, well, I call him a friend, I had a colleague that wanted to mess with 1478 because he thought it'd be funny. So he went in there, he came out 10 minutes later, grabbed my handgun out of my satchel and blew his brains out right then and there. It was crazy. 1478 is not to be messed with, but if it does like you, it can be quite relieving after a hard day of work to go in there and just, you know, chill with it. It's kind of like a dog, kind of, you know, just kind of, you know, it's kind of like a pet of some sort. I don't really know how to explain it. You'll just have to get your, you know, come see it sometime. I wouldn't recommend it, though. You try to come into Site-19 and they'll blow your freaking brains out. Anyway, so that's the object today, and the picture should be up on the screen, so you see what it looks like. It's freaking adorable. But, uh, it's not just cute. Um, what they didn't tell you in the file is apparently 1478 has telekinetic powers. One time, there was, uh, Agent... Well, I can't say his name. I'm already in enough trouble. Well, he went in there, he went to its cell, and started tearing apart its bedding for some reason. I guess he was having a bad day. 1478 picked him up using telekinesis or something, and slammed him into a wall so hard head first that his head caved in. It was crazy. Let's just say the cleanup crew for that week wasn't too happy. <laughs> Alright guys, well, I gotta get off here. I gotta go check something out. Uh, I should be uploading again tonight, maybe. I don't know. Tell me what you think. And, you know, I'll get back to you if I'm still alive. Later.